Hey dolls, second video of the day and as you saw earlier I did an unboxing of my long shot bag so now I'm going to do a what's in my bag tag video. So for those of you who didn't see, this is my long shot Le Pliage and it's all black, it's a medium size. I wanted the black and brown but they didn't have it um, in the outlet that I went to. So I got the all black and I'll probably order the black and brown one online. <clears throat> but I also wanted to go to the store to make sure I got the correct size that I wanted for my body size, my height and everything. I'm 4'10". So the small was actually too small for me because I do like bigger bags and the large was too big. So I got the medium and it has this flap here that you have to open before you can unzip it. And then you unzip it. Sorry, I know it's like blocking my view. I'm on my iPad recording. And we'll jump right in. So first of all, usually my phone is in there, but I had it out. So my phone, well not usually because I just unboxed it today, but my phone was in there. Then in that little side pocket that I showed you guys, I have, I still have the long shot uh, little booklet pamphlet thing in there. <laughs> I have a lip gloss and have a tattoo oil. You guys know that's my favorite candy. Um, <clears throat> I have a list. My schedule for the week. Or for the next couple of weeks. Next, all the way through October. Because I am. My schedule changed because I'm. Working for my cousin who is on maternity leave. So. Have schedule uh, my schedule changed. Anyway. My keys. These keys have. My job key. Uh, I think a key to a safe in my mother's house, a knife key, a key to the knife cabinet at my job because we lock it so that the residents won't get in there. This key is the key to my mother's room, which used to be my room, so that's why I still have the key. Key to my house and the key to my mother's house, and then all my keychains. This is my car key. It has a little souvenir from my college. And my friend went to Trinidad and Tobago, brought me this back. And this cross is from a praise and worship conference at my church. This was one of the little souvenirs they gave out in our um, booklet, in our folder. Then, down in the bag is my, which I use for a wallet, my mini pochette by Louis Vuitton. It's a limited edition one. So it has like the bags on it and everything. And I had it since 2009, so you can see everything is like wearing off. But, um, yeah. Then I have my sunglasses, which my friends call the sunshades. <laughs> I have my ibuprofen, which I always have to keep with me. Headaches, toothache, cramps, all that. My little mini rice cookie treat. I bought a, like now that Halloween is coming, they have like, the big bags in case you want to give out like rice cookie treats for Halloween so it's a big bag and it has all the mini rice cookie treats in it I have a bag of popcorn people usually tell me I have my life in my bag but I always need to have my little snacks on the go um my hand sanitizer because I am a germaphobe um this book called Transparent I actually bought this book years ago when I was home before I went away to school, I was always into, um, I was always ordering online from christianbookstore.com. And this was a book I ordered way back when. And then when I went away to school, I left it here. I never got a chance to read it. Took it out a few months ago and was supposed to read it and still got busy. So now I'm hoping, being that my schedule has changed a bit and I'll have a little more time, that I finally get to read it. It's called uh, Transparent. It's by Sarah Zacharias Davis. And it says, getting honest about who we are and who we want to be. So, yeah. I will let you guys know how that is. My Mentos. My mint of choice these days. And a pack of m &Ms. I've had these for a while and I haven't opened them. So, it's about time I open them and eat them. Move on to the next. <laughs> and that is it. And the bag looks small, so you wouldn't think that there was much in it. But it held all of that. So I'm excited about this bag. I'm also excited about getting the other one because that's the one I originally wanted. So 
I may end up either keeping this one or giving it away. Not sure yet, but I do love it. But I know I like the contrast of the colors with the black and brown one. So we shall see what happens. But that's what's in my bag for this bag. I know I have some other bags that I still never did the what's in my bag for. Like my Louis Vuitton Artsy. I was supposed to do that a while ago. So maybe the next time I wear that, I'll hopefully try to remember to do that. But um, yeah. Being that I wore this one today, I decided to do a video so it wouldn't get put off and all that stuff. So yeah, I appreciate you all, whether you're a new or old subscriber. If you're not subscribed, subscribe now. You won't regret it. And yeah, tell your friends and family about my page. And until the next video, stay blessed.